true life, I'm a parent. It's Jason Pullman and Katie Bright in the morning on US 99, Chicago's hottest country. Let's check in with the two parents on this little radio program. <laughs> first of all, first and foremost, number one, Katie Bright, the mother of a three-year-old, Sammy the Snack, <laughs> and, and little Leo. What's it like being a mom, Katie? Oh, it's just so easy. <laughs> it's just so, so blessed. It's just so easy. Um, no, it's hard. I mean, two, I have two boys and they're all boy and they're they fight and they argue and they push each other and they're, you know, it's it's hard. It's not, of course, there are some really wonderful moments as well. They're sweet as can be, but it is not easy. It's like survival mode right now. That's what they call this stage of life. When you have a three-year-old and a six-year-old, people call it like, oh, you're in survival mode. Uh-huh. I'm still in that mode. But yeah, so the other day, uh, I was washing the windows in the front of the house inside, just like little Windex the windows, and I look out and I see our three-year-old halfway down the street with our dog, just walking what? the dog in his pajamas. <laughs> mm-hmm. Wait, had he ever walked the dog That's... on his own ever? What? No, he's free. <laughs> no. Somehow he got the leash down, just decided to hook up. And I was like, I am a bad parent that I wouldn't have even noticed. But he was he was inside watching like a movie with his brother. And he just decided to like take our dog Newton for a walk. So he gets the leash, hooks up. the. I didn't even know he could hook the leash. Hooks the leash. <laughs> And then I see him, he put his own little shoes on in his pajamas and he's walking the dog down the street. And I opened, I ran out and I'm like, Sam, Sammy! I was like, what are you, what are you doing? And I was kind of like mad at the dog. I was like, how, how does the, the dog- How did you let this happen, I was, Newton? Yeah, I was looking at the dog. The dog was like, well, hell yeah, I'm going for a walk. Let's go. I was like so excited. <laughs> I got a poop. I was like, oh, you know what? It was that moment where I was like, you know, I do consider myself a good mom, but I was like, how did this happen? How did this just All happen? you were doing was you were doing windows for just, just a minute. You took your eyes off him for I a mean, half a second. Seriously. And he's out taking the dog for a what, walk. Wait, what was his response? Oh, he, he just said, well, I just wanted to take the, I just wanted to take Newton for a walk. You got to do it in Sammy's voice though. And I was like, I was like, dude, can you ask me to go with you next time? I mean, <laughs> little dude. True life. I'm a parent on US 99. Parent number two on our little radio program, <laughs> Scotty, the father of a nine-year-old you're also engaged to Shelby. What's that like these days? Oh, you know, it's grand. We're uh, nowhere near the wedding process. So thanks for bringing that up. But that's yeah, good. Right. Good. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'll tell you, Katie, I think you hit it on the head, right? So as parents, we have these brain farts and we try to do the best we can. And sometimes you mess up and sometimes you let your kid get hurt. And sometimes you accidentally make your kid cry right. in my case. So Chance uh, plays soccer uh, out in Tinley Park and... Uh, and he's been playing traveling. He's been playing so well. The, and the only thing I ever get on him is if he doesn't try his hardest, right? Like, I don't mind mistakes, but sometimes he gets lazy and he's like, I don't know. We'll see what I'll do as best I can today. Right. So they got their butt kicked in this game, by the way. And I'm definitely that soccer coach that, or soccer dad, I should say, on the sideline. You're that, yelling? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm, what was the, what was the score? Loud. I don't, I don't want to say. It was like, I'm even embarrassed. Like, no, go I ahead. What was it? I don't, it was like eight to two or eight to one. I don't know. It was okay. bad. It was, it, was, bad it, it was like a Bears game. Yeah. yeah it okay. was, yes. Yeah. It was, yeah. <laughs> yes. It was basically like that. So, and there were points where I felt like he was getting lazy out there, tired, whatever the case may be. And after the game, he wanted to play soccer and kick around and shoot goals with his friend. And he said, Dad, Dad, can I stay and, and, and kick some goals? And I, and it just came out, guys. I didn't I didn't mean for it to sound the way it did. But I go, no, if you wanted to play soccer, you should have done it during the game. Oh. oh. <laughs> that hurts. Throwing right. salt in the I wound. Felt, I, and as soon Thanks. as I said it, I was right. like, oh, my God, I was joking. And he just started crying. Oh. And I was like, oh, it's just a joke, buddy. I'm sorry. I know you tried real hard. You and he goes, being like sarcastic. I he was. Didn't get it. He and, did not get it. And his mom and my fiance, Shelby, were both like, dang, you went there. And uh, Chance looked at me with his little crying eyes. And he goes, you didn't have to be a jerk about it. And I was like, yeah. you're right. I did. I'm yeah, sorry. Dad. Oh, my God. Let's go for ice cream, kid. Uh, yeah, right. All the ice cream. Anything you want. Cookies, too. You want a unicorn? I'll buy you one. There you go. And that wraps up the very first episode <laughs> of True Life. I'm a parent. Yeah. You're only one minute.